hello and a warm welcome to you all guys and girls in this video tutorial i'm going to explain you some of the very much important tips which you should know before creating a website because uh, if you are not planned before creating a website you might be in a problem while creating the website because especially if you are a new babe to the field of web designing so let's uh, let me introduce you what should you know first of all decide the category of the website that means uh, what is the motto of our website of your website which in which category does it exist whether that is a it is for information it is an information based website or that is a e-commerce website uh, which would uh, do some sales whether a blog personal blog or that is a classified or directory website it whether it is an online booking or college website it is important it is important to decide earlier before creating and before purchasing domain name and uh, hosting space because of the first reason why because the reason one is that uh, if we have already decided that uh, i'm going to create a website of school or college uh, then it will help you in uh, choosing the proper domain name extensions like dot com dot org dot info dot edu dot ac dot in or uh, there are a lot many things so if you are not uh, clear with the concept of your uh, website uh, then uh, it's, it's it's a bit difficult to say that uh, what extension you are going to choose because dot com is for commercial purpose of website dot org is for organization of website dot dot info is for uh, informative website uh, dot edu for um, registered technical education website dot ac dot is in is also for the same and there are a lot many things if suppose if you use only dot com for each and every type of website then um, actually what problem would have that uh, if that would be an educational website and if you are using it a dot com then google would uh, not uh, take it uh, a bit seriously in the search results uh, okay so these are certain things uh, and there are a lot many factors which also affect your website uh, um, so that's much important if you know that what exactly is your uh, concept of the website what is the category of the website you select your appropriate extensions while purchasing <coughs> second reason uh, it will help you help it will help you in choosing the proper web hosting plans web hosting spa space and plans okay suppose uh, that uh, if you are going to create an e-commerce site okay so for creating an e-commerce site it is very clear that you have to use uh, um, the available softwares here in the market okay uh, like uh, magento commerce os commerce uh, perista soft open cart or there are a lot many so for example take uh, I, I i used to uh, to uh, <coughs> install I uh, used to uh, take the help of OS commerce hmm, software for creating my online site so uh, uh, first of all you have to know the what is the minimum requirement for the OS commerce okay so if if um, uh, I know that OS commerce uh, need a Linux uh, li uh, it requires a Linux hosti hosting or Windows hosting what kind of ex ex data base basic support as SQL or Acre or uh, MS access how much minimum hosting space is required to install that particular online software or platform mm. so if unless and until you don't know um, your type uh, of your category of website you cannot uh, know the which software which online uh, software or content management system you are going to install on your hosting space and um, uh, the, until uh, until you don't know what exactly would be the requirement of that particular things uh, <coughs> okay so this is much important once you know which uh, what is your category of website you would know that uh, um, which software would be compatible or which cms which content management system you are going to use and if you know the, the content management system uh, you can see what are the minimum requirements uh, for the hosting to install that particular software for your online website or uh, you can um, by referring that minimum requirement you can see the service provider the company is uh, and uh, purchase your desired hosting plan okay this is the reason 
<coughs> so uh, once you decide and you so once you check out all those things then uh, you can go for uh, go and register your domain name and purchase a hosting space i would suggest you some of the best company for a domain name registration and web hosting space i would so i personally recommend you that godaddy is one of the best best uh, company which offers a uh, web uh, domain registration hosting and lo lot many things than others its competitor it has left all other its competitor very far away it's, this is the one of the company which is being used by all the major giant companies right now for web space uh, hosting and uh, uh, domain registration so this is the number one i personally use this one i am very much satisfied with this service so i would recommend you to do, go ahead with this <coughs> however it is a bit costly but the service and the thing is very real, reliable so there are other companies are good okay like big rocks domains.in atc so th that's all uh, okay uh, in the next video tutorial i will explain um what how to i will explain how to uh, go and register a domain okay and what is the uh, how what is private registration what is public registration okay and now uh, what what kind of uh, space would be how to purchase space how to attach uh, um, hosting space uh, from different company uh, hosting or to uh, different company domain name registry uh, star provider so guys and girls if you really uh, like my video just kindly subscribe to my video or if you have any confusion just write in the comment box i will definitely help you thanks a lot for watching watch the next video tutorials thanks bye bye